Honestly, I would I I think I'd be more inclined to buy a lot of these if they were all like 50 bucks across the board, you know? Squadcast action happening again with Gabble the Giver. How are you, sir? Good and you. You feeling extra soft skin today? Oh yeah. Oh, extra. Okay, good. And the best thing is happiness. Happiness. I wish, I wish everybody is having happiness. My friend, my friend Gabo, can you read this, sir? If you were to put together a cross-platform mini console monstrosity, what 50 game will be a must? Amen. Also, thank you to my cat's cool for the question. Thank you, thank you my cat's cool. My cat's not cool because I don't have a cat. Gabo, yeah, you want to run this? Basically, the way I kind of look at this, obviously, we're not going to go through 50 games right now in the moment. You know, well, yeah. Um, it's funny because the other day I was talking with Mikey about this. Really? Uh, yeah. I remember he was saying that he would love to have a, I think it was a N64 Mini. Yeah. That's probably the most popular one. But for me, I would love to have a, a GameCube. GameCube Mini. I like that. And I love a lot of people, too. So uh, what what are I'm, some of your highlight games? Must must uh, be must the Star Wars. Okay. Rogue Squadron one, I think. Yep. Uh Luigi's Mansion, Mario Sunshine. Uh there's too many, man. Too Would many. you are was was the pod racing Star Wars game on GameCube or no? I don't think so. Okay. Maybe Mario, not. I don't know, man. <laughs> That's okay. You don't have to know. Mario no. Sunshine, uh, Mario Sunshine. Oh. Four Sword. Ooh. Oh, I know what one I'd want on there. The Star Fox. Eternal Darkness. Eternal da Darkness. Star Fox. Time Splitter. Yeah. Um, yeah, dude. I, those are some good choices. Yeah. For me, the one I would want, I, I, I'm debate between two that I don't, I don't know which one I would say I want the most, but I would say that definitely I would want a, let's see, I think I have it queued up some commercial not atari not atari <laughs> that's just the name of the channel uh i think i'd want a sega master system mini i would like a sega master system mini because that's true it, it's it's hard like i see every console out there in the wild game hunting with the games but i don't really see much sega master system stuff yeah. in the wild it's really hard to pick up for and they they skip it because they go right to genesis yeah it was like it never existed yeah i was like oh thanks you know Sega Master has really good games. The Sega Master System does have really good games. And I think, like I said, just being so hard to come across certain cartridges, um, it would make sense because it's just not very easy for them to to give us these things. You know, I would love to see uh, Space Harrier, uh, Psycho Fox, uh, Vigilante. The uh, ones. Yeah, Alien Syndrome. Alien oh, Syndrome. Look at that. Yeah, Thunderblade. I actually do like th Al Rocky. I love yeah. Rocky. Oh, oh, right there. That's my go-to. Fantasy uh, Star, bro. What else? Um, uh, Renegade? Renegade's no, awesome. Plante. Yeah, but Renegade is an awesome game. Yeah. Well, I wonder too, something that I would think would be cool, and I don't know why this isn't done yet, or there's got to be some sort of technology to do it, but to include, uh, just like the NES Classic, to include the Zapper or something, or, you know, and the Sega Masters to include the, the 3D glasses or something in some way that makes sense, you know? Yeah, but the problem is with the TV, well... Um, There's got to be a technology of somehow. Yeah. I don't know. Somehow. Oh, what was that game? That one? Yeah. That? Oh, My Hero? Yeah, My Hero. That game was My Hero. I don't know if I saw it in time. I was looking at something else. <laughs> You remember the game in the Ghost House? It was Ghost House, right? Yeah, Ghost House. Yep. Ghost House, really. It good was game. like it was like almost like it played kind of like a Mappy Land type game, but darker. Yeah, it, was, it was Alice Kid in a Ghost House. Yeah, and you do you play as the Dracula character? I can't remember. No, you play as the Alice Kid guy. Ooh, I love Shinobi on Shinobi. on the Master System. I love oh, that version. Like Shinobi. There is a lot of people who don't like Shinobi on the Master System. There's a large community of people who don't. Double Dragon. It was the in that generation it was the closest to arcade. And Double Dragon on the NES was single player. Double Dragon on Sega Master System. Was oh wow. Yep. Do you have another one, Gabo? Uh yes. PS2 Mini. Oh wow, that would be 
that would be amazing uh but oh my god there's so many games i don't have to mention because yeah. the ps2 is like a powerhouse of games. yeah yeah uh dreamcast is a big one for me but I think the one I would want the most second to Master System. Uh, let me see. Can I pull this up? How do I pull these up here? Oh, I don't know how. Dang it. Oh, yeah, I do. Haha. Here we go. Look at me learning things. I'm just running this game because it's built off it. Um, I would love to see an arcade classic. Like a main? Like a main. And obviously, I don't want to actually play the little arcade. I, I'm not a fan of that. I know oh, a lot of people do that. The problem, the problem, that's too difficult because of there's so many good arcades and licenses. I know, but still, I would still like it. Oh, and I know. The retro pie. And I know that there is like the Capcom stick that you can buy that's like a big, yeah. you know, like a stick. But I'm a sucker for arcade games. And I would love to see. Obviously, it's a wish list. It's a wish list. Not just the Konami ones or not just the Capcom ones. I'd love to see, like we see with this, just like 50 awesome arcade games on a little joystick. It doesn't have to be as big as an actual, you know, fighter stick. You can be the size of a Apple keyboard, you know? I wonder how, how good is the mini Turbo graphics? I you know, know it, there's a, I know there's a lot of people that review it, but I didn't see any. It's funny too. I was so excited for that, and then when it came out, I never did anything with it. Like I never even well, bought it. Probably it's because it's too expensive. How much was that one? I know the Genesis is what eighty bucks. I check eBay and all those places it was like one fifty. Oh, see, yeah, that's too much. Yeah, that's too much. Probably it was the whole the what do you call the the holders? No, the scalpers. The scalpers. Yeah. What do you think is a good price point for a mini console? For a mini console, the, the a, a fair good price from sixty to eighty. Sixty to eighty. Okay. That's See, I no, honestly, I would, I, I think I'd be more inclined to buy a lot of these if they were all like fifty bucks across the board. You know, yeah. just because I do like all of them per se, <laughs> but I can't justify myself spending eighty on this one, ninety on this one, eighty four plus tax you know what i mean it's a lot of money you know what is funny i was thinking you was going to say uh n64 mini uh, you know i the n64 is one of those consoles that i love but i only love a very specific amount of games it's the same with me with the Dreamcast. got it it's like think about it and i know people is gonna fire at me for this the Dreamcast think 20 games you can put that is that worth it put it there i could pull up about 20 i think really wow. yeah probably i don't know nothing about dreamcast well <laughs> let me do this over here list of dreamcast oh wait oh dude i forgot one i got what? a third one what 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 mini saturn oh yeah that'd be great that'd be awesome or mini stega cd Mini Sega CD, I like that. Okay, I'm looking at Dreamcast games right now. Um, I, I like the sports games on the Dreamcast, so I feel like that could be a good. Okay, that was amazing. One. NFL 2K1. Yeah. Virtual Tennis is actually a... for tennis. Uh, I really Can... like what was that game? Blue, blue, blue key, something like that. Blue Stinger. Blue, blue Stinger was really good. Blue well, Stinger. It was good. There's Cannon Spike is great. Cannon Spike. Capcom versus Capcom versus SNKs. Yeah, but I don't think they're gonna put that over there. But yeah, Carrier, that's a good one. Uh, Choo 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 Rocket. Don't remember that one. Crazy Taxis. Yes. Uh, Daytona USA was actually really cool in the Dreamcast. I like really? that game a lot. Yeah. Uh, what was the zombie ones? Uh, I thought that was uh, uh, uh oh House of Dead. House of the Dead. That's a must one. Those are great games. Oh, yeah. Evolution. Those games are pretty cool, too. Like an RPG style. I think it was RPG. Get Ryan Radio. Ooh, Gauntlet Legends. Um, I, Godzilla I, Generation. I take back what I say. <laughs> there's a plenty <laughs> of game to put on Dreamcast. Sorry, guys. No, there, there's a good amount, but I get what you're saying. And, and I, it, I guess it's not like a mainstream Nintendo platform where you can Dude, easily name them all off. The other games that it was like uh, party games. It was two. Oh, did we say Power Stone? Power Stone. That's amazing. Yeah, dude. One and two, really good. 
And don't they have like hang time and stuff on here, like the fun ones? No, I think they have uh, like NBA Jam 2000. Okay. Silent think... Scope, it was really good. Oh, Silent Scope was good. Oh, Rain Rayman 2. Rayman 2, yeah. I take back what I say. Oh, you know what games I really love that I just see on here that I forgot about? I loved uh, Sega Rally Championship, but I also love San Francisco Rush. Mm, never played before. Ricky and I used to, oh, oh my gosh, we forgot about the most obvious. Everyone's going to kill us. The, Shen, the Shenmue games. Yeah, and Sonic Adventures. We're forgetting like the most obvious games. Yeah. Spawn. Oops. Space Channel 5, Soul Calibur. Soul Calibur, oh my God. The yeah. last day, but I think those are Japanese. Oh, Virtua Fighter. Virtua Fighter, Kino Fighter. Virtua Cop. Oh. Oh, and don't forget, Worms. Yeah. Uh, okay, definitely I take back what I say. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's all good, dude. And that's probably yeah. how I am with the Nintendo 64. I feel the same way. When I think of the Nintendo 64, I think of like 15 games. But if I probably looked at a list, I'd be like, oh, okay, there's more than I remember. You know what I mean? Yeah. I think it was with Mikey that I was talking about the N64 okay. the same day. And I was telling him, like, like to be honest, I don't love the N64 like, like almost everybody. Yeah. Because for me, it was only a couple of games. <laughs> Probably it's because I jumped so quick from N64 to PS1. Got it. Sorry, I'm looking at this thing. because I the difference. Back then, you can see the difference between the PS1 games and N64. Yeah. And I remember I remember I make my decision back then to stop buying games to N64 and buying on PS1. Wow. Right, right after I play Mortal Kombat Mythologies. The Mythologies? Why you like that game? I really like it. That's one that's other game that there's a lot of people that hate it, but I love it. Got it. So I, I, remember, I remember on the PS1, you can watch movies, the CGI and everything. Yeah. The movies and N64, it was just a picture. Yeah. Same with Mortal Kombat 4. Yep. So I say, ah, come on, man. Come so, on, man. Come on, man. I broke my thing just now. That's why I was staring at this. I'm kind of bummed. Oh, yeah. I won't oh, be able to tighten it again. It, it, the thing that tightened it fell off. That, that fasting is making you a strong. I'm a strong man now. Not true. Definitely not. Who do you think is the stronger in the squad? You or Mikey, for sure. I, I, we're talking a lot about Mikey. Mikey is really strong, dude. I, Mikey, I, w you remember that day we was uh, filming in Bobby's when he, he grabbed me? Yeah. I was amazed, dude. No, Mikey's a strong dude. I, I was in the office when he used to arm wrestle everybody and like, dude, he's a strong dude. No, dude. He got a big hands, big big arms. Yeah, he's huge. His whole upper, he's like Donkey Kong, dude. Yeah, he's Donkey Kong. <laughs> That's and what I'm, I'm, That's and what I'm like, he's a, a cute Jogi Bear. And I'm like Dixie Kong. At best. So, all right, that's it for this what is one. Ricky? What is Ricky? Ricky is, <laughs> got, uh... I got the perfect one. You who? remember... <laughs> uh oh You remember Clay Fighter? Yeah. Tangy man, it was Tangy man. The taffy guy? Taffy guy. <laughs> I'm getting out of here. We're out of here today. Uh, oh, let it. Another one. What? Edward Jim. Er, Ricky is Earthworm Jim. Edward Ricky. Edward Ricky. Well, all right. I'm gonna leave it there with uh, this one on the table. <laughs> what mini console would you like? Mostly what games? You know, kind of a wish list, kind of fun. All right, Gal. We're out of here today. Let's not make fun of our friends. We love our friends. Okay, we're out of here. Mm -hmm.